Welcome back to the Sports Site for Unplugged. Gabe Salgado here at Big Ten Basketball Media Day at the Higher Regency O'Hare in Rosemont. And I'm here with uh, Illinois Fighting Illini guard Revante Rice, and I know you guys, you got to be pumped for this season. Oh, uh, yeah, man, we're pumped, bro. We can't wait oh, to no, get back that, out there. No, I mean, we're just coming that, ready to compete every day of practice, and we're just coming ready. Now, you guys lost uh, Tracy Abrams for the year. He uh, had an injury in practice. How has it affected the team? Um, I mean, uh, it's obviously a big loss, but, I mean, it's not like he's not there. But, I mean, he's just going to be on the sideline just uh, giving up his advice and telling us what uh, situations he think we can take advantage of. Now, because of that injury, has Coach changed anything fundamentally with you guys, or is it still the same? Uh, no, it's still the same. Um, he, he's going to have me uh, run point a little bit, like behind Ahmad and uh, Jay Tate. So, I mean, uh, yeah, just knowing, like, we're going to have to switch our games up and uh, make sacrifices. Now, when you transferred to Illinois, there was a lot of press about how you changed your diet, got yourself in better shape and everything else. Uh, uh, tell us about that. Um, it was just a good process for me. I mean, I think I needed to do it. I mean, uh, I got we had a nutritionist that was just great and a weight coach that just had a great plan for me, and we just executed. So now this year, you guys pretty much have the same team intact aside from Tracy being injured. What are your expectations for this year? Oh, we really ain't uh, predicting anything. The goal is to make it to the Big Ten turn. I mean, I make it to the tournament and then uh, compete to win the Big Ten tournament. So we're just going to come and just give it our all, and hopefully that's the end of the result. Now, last year you guys were in the NIT, made it to the second round, if I remember correctly. What was that experience like for you? I mean, it was good to get out there and compete against uh, people like you haven't like, played before, like Clemson and uh, Boston College. I mean, those both were great games, but, like, I mean, obviously uh, we – Wanted to make it to the tournament. We just came up short. So, I mean, just, we're going to come ready to compete every every day this year and hopefully the tournament is uh, out there. How do you like the new uniforms? Uh, I mean, they're great, man. We got we got a lot of new ones, and uh, I really don't have a favorite one yet, but I mean, I'm just looking forward to getting out there and wearing them. Now, you were telling other members in the media here earlier that your favorite player is Kobe Bryant. He's coming off some injuries. He's uh, been going through some things the last couple of years. Do you think he'll bounce back this year? Uh, yeah, I mean, I think he'll bounce back, man. I mean, uh, he's Black Mamba, man. I mean, he's uh, great. <laughs> Now, obviously, with uh, Rutgers and Maryland coming into the conference, you guys will probably be traveling east a lot more often. What's that like to you? Um, I mean, it's going to be great to uh, play in that type of environment. I mean, it's different. They bring a different type of style to the uh, to the league. So, I mean, we're just going to come ready to compete every game. Ray, good luck this season, and thank you for your time. All right, thank you, man. I'm Gabe Salgado, and you're listening to the Sports Cypher Unplugged.